I'm Michael George. I'm one of Hollywood's most sought after personal trainers, a personal health coach, and the author of Body Express Makeover. Today, my pro tip for you is my travel and outdoor band workout program. It's a total body program. You're gonna do two sets of anywhere from 15 to 25 exercises of each exercise. Now, the nice thing about working with bands is they're extremely portable. You can travel with them very easily. Um, you can also double up on the bands. If you're working with a band and you're not getting enough resistance in any movement that you're doing, you can, you can change your proximity to where the band is located. And I'll show you this throughout the workout to get more resistance. You can also double up on, on bands. Now, typically you have three different bands when you buy a set of bands. You have the, uh, the blue one, which is the, the heaviest one, the red one, which is more of a medium uh, weighted one, and then you have the green band, which is the lightest one, which most women are going to work with. So today I'm going to show you how to work with this program and do a total body workout with just the bands alone and your body weight, of course. So we're going to start with the first exercise. We're just going to do a set of push-ups to get warmed up. So I'll start with 15 push-ups, back straight, straight down. Focus on your breathing, keeping your back straight. That's it. This is just going to warm up your upper body a little bit. Good. Okay, so our first band exercise, we're going to start with chest press. So you want to find a, a pole, a tree, a column, anything you can wrap a band around. Put it right around like that. Starting with chest press, you're going to step in. Make sure the band is, is equal on both sides. And you're going to step out with one foot in a staggered stance. And again, if you want uh, more resistance, you step out further. If you want less resistance, you come in more. And I'm just going to do 20 reps here, just like this. Now, if I want more resistance, I'm going to come out a little further. And you start feeling this after a while. That's it. So you do anywhere from 15 to 25 reps of chest press. Okay, our next exercise, I'm gonna do standing rows. Now my back is a very strong muscle group, so I'm gonna double up on my bands here because I have a strong back and I really wanna work my back hard. So I double up on the bands, bring them around, make sure that the, the tension is equal on both sides. Again, a staggered stance, back straight, and just pulling it in, coming forward with full extension keeping your chest up. Now I'm really working the, the back and the rhomboids pretty hard. Okay, now I wanna go right into my triceps. I'm gonna do double kickbacks. So I'm dropping one band, making sure it's equal on both sides. Double kickbacks. One foot forward, bend the knees, arch your back, elbows up high. Bending at the elbow hinge only. Straight back, you can see how my triceps are working. I'm actually feeling this exercise a lot. Now if I want harder work, I want to make it harder, I step out more. And it's much harder. If it's too hard, step back in again. The nice thing about bands is you can change the resistance and you can crank out lots of reps with these things. It's really good. The bands are really good again for sculpting and toning really quick, really fast. Um, chest flies. Next exercise. So we're gonna wrap it around the pole again. Make sure it's equal on both sides. I'm gonna step out, staggered stance, make sure I'm square. Bring them out in front and come back, working the chest, the upper chest here. It's a fly motion. Now if I want more resistance, step out a little bit more. Now I can really feel this. That's it. Again, you do anywhere from 15 to 25 reps. If you can't feel the work after 25 reps, you either need to double up in your bands or step out more, get more resistance. Rear delts, next exercise. Gonna work the back of the shoulders, staggered stance again, make sure it's even. And we're just gonna do the reverse fly motion, working the rear delts. Good. Next exercise, bicep curls. 
The nice thing about bands is you can move through the exercises extremely quickly too. So you just stand on the band, make sure it's equal on both sides, and bend the knees slightly, bicep curls. Now you can really feel this, really feel this working. Good. From here, we're going to go into shoulder press. So a shoulder press, best way to do this is just to stand on the band to make sure it doesn't pop up at all. One foot, bring them up behind you, and come straight up. Doing your shoulder press with a staggered stance again. That's it. Now if you work this band program the right way, and you work through every exercise quickly and you burn it out, each exercise, you're going to feel this. You're going to feel the pump after the workout. Next exercise, tricep extensions. Good way to do this is just drop the band down and step on it, bring it up behind you. Grab a hold of your elbow to support your arm. Again, I'm working my triceps a different way now. I did the double, double kickbacks earlier. Now I'm doing the tricep kickbacks. Again, you can really feel this. And then, of course, I'd switch arms, so I'd switch legs. Just drop the band down, step on top of it, wrap it behind, elbow up, support it, come straight up. Good. Next exercise, side lateral raises. We'll use the red bands for this. We're going to do two more exercises. Side lateral raises and front lateral raises. Stand on the band, make sure it's equal on both sides, and then coming up to the side. Bring the arms out laterally, up to eye level, keep your knees slightly bent. So you do 15 to 20 of those, and then you would do four lateral raises. Just like that. And that is your travel outdoor band workout, your pro tip from me today.